Hello and welcome to Prism View version 11. In this training, I'm going to show you how to set up and get your first content running out on the sign. You'll learn how to add media to Prism View, edit and create messages, and then add that media to your playlist for scheduling. First, you'll want to set up your folder for media. To do this, simply right click on the media folder and create a new folder. You can rename this later to your liking. Now let's add some media. You can drag and drop artwork like images or video right into the media folder. You can also use the Prism View Editor to resize and crop images and videos to fit your LED sign. To do this, let's go to the Content tab. And here we are going to click on the New Animation button, and this will load the Prism View Editor. For images, click on the Graphic button, and for animations, the Animation Background button. Now we'll click on the load background and import your video or image. To crop the media, click on the best fit button. You can adjust the position of the crop box by dragging it around. Note you will also want to keep the X coordinate at zero, otherwise you'll get black bars on the sides. Now click import and Prism View will bring that into the editor. You can now add text by going back to the text tab. Type your text in the white box below and your text will appear on the screen on the display sign. Uh, you can adjust the text color, the size, the font, different things like that. And you will also probably want to adjust the hold time uh, so your message plays the desired amount of time on the sign. Now that you've edited the file, it's ready to go. Simply click save and exit and that will automatically be saved as a PX2 file in your media folder. Now that we've got media, it's time to schedule it to play on the sign. You can drag and drop the media from your folder into the playlist. And the playlist will rotate through these, so put them in the order you want them to play. Uh, if you don't want your sign to play 24-7, you can click on the Edit Playlist Operating Hours, and you can adjust the times there. Now you know the basics, keep watching to learn more.